You know, Dwayne Haskins got his face in some booty cheeks and no, <laughs> yeah. no masters the other day. Dewey. He said he apologized. He said he'll learn from that and Owned move up on. To it. Okay, he said he's gonna. It was immature and everything like that. Yeah. Uh, okay, so hopefully he'll be able to do that. Mm -hmm. He doesn't have COVID though, I guess. Right? We would have learned if he got COVID somehow. Probably. So that particular strip club, I don't know where he was. Adult Ballet. They are COVID free for those mm -hmm. in the area. Good for them. Good for them. Congrats to them. Social distancing, I'd assume, in times and everything like that. Let's yeah. clear something up here with uh, the Washington football team. Dwayne Haskins lost the C. To be honest, him having the C on was intriguing to me whenever they decided to no longer play him because it felt like he got benched out of nowhere. And then there was rumors that there was something happening off the field. I was like, well, if he's not working as hard as you want or you don't think he's as committed as enough, how did he get the C? And I guess the players voted the C on him. Now, after what happened with the booty cheeks and his maskless face the other day, he has lost his C in Washington, is in quite a situation. Tom Pelissero, do you have anything to expound upon that? I mean, add that that tweet and that news story to the list of things that I've put out this year that have felt like parody as I'm typing them, but it's just kind of the, the universe that we're living in right now. I mean, yeah. Dwayne Haskins, you go back to the beginning of the season, listen, he's a young quarterback with a new offensive scheme. He didn't have an off season. It was going to be a challenge for him. Uh, I know there was a lot of back and forth about the reasons he was benched, but what happens in the week or two after that, you know, he gets busted at the team hotel for trying to bring a visitor in, which is not allowed under the COVID protocols, gets confronted by Ron Rivera, is not immediately upfront with Rivera about it. He gets fined for that. Now you fast forward, and, and only because of a, a crazy series of circumstances with Kyle Allen get hurt, then Alex Smith getting hurt, the Haskins even get another opportunity to go into the game. So he's you know hours removed from a post-game press conference in which he's talking about throwing a couple of interceptions, one of which was admittedly a really bad uh, interception by him. And he's then, you know, getting photographed in a strip club without a mask on. I yeah. mean, these are these are things that you just think should not happen, much less among one of your captains, a guy who's at a, a leadership position uh, like quarterback. It's a situation that obviously the Washington football team and Ron Rivera have been dealing with here, stripping of the C. I would expect there's going to be additional discipline beyond that. They're not going to release the guy, though, and they're kind of in a spot where they're trying to win the NFC East. If they don't play Dwayne Haskins and Alex Smith isn't ready, you're talking about Taylor Heineke uh, starting oh. a potentially pivotal game coming up this week. I mean, it's a really delicate situation because of the stage of the season that you're at. If this happens in May, maybe this goes a totally other direction. If we weren't in COVID, there. would this be a big problem still? What's that? If this was just a normal season, but they just saw him out at the strip club? Uh, no, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, Some of the captains no, with no, him. Yeah, right? yeah. <laughs> well, I was about to say that when Tom was like in a leadership position, I'm like, do we know if anybody else was there? Was Dwayne <laughs> paying for the boys? Yeah. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? It's a little bit different story, I think. <laughs> yeah.